So let's look at the eye injection from a skull, like an anatomy standpoint. So obviously we have our skull, we have our mandible that we're trying to numb, we're trying to get to the nerve before it branches. So the goal is to hit the opening, the foramen, before it branches off into other nerves. So this is our mat maxilla and mandible together. Okay, I have another skull where I took the mandible off, okay? So when you look at a mandible, this is our target, this foramen right here. So what I like to do is when I feel, let me move that. So I like to feel for the external oblique ridge, that's the big bone, roll your finger in, feel for that internal. So this patient has a third molar, so usually that tooth's not in the way. But you're gonna roll in a little bit, feel for that little bump where it kind of drops off so roll in, you're gonna feel it. You won't be able to see it, but you're gonna feel that. And then I like to keep my thumb, if you're allowed to keep your thumb in the mouth with the injection, because if I put my needle, I'm gonna bypass that bone right away and get to that foramen. Most people hit bone early because they're hitting right here. See that? If that's the case and we try to go around it, sometimes especially if they have really bulky bone right here, it's impossible to get around. So if you keep your finger there, kind of keep an eyeball at where that external and internal is, you're gonna bypass that bone and be able to get to your maximum. And then you're gonna hit the nerve right before it goes into the mandible so that it'll numb all the teeth in this quadrant.